Two fishermen lost at sea have been found highlighting the need for better communication systems for fisher folk. Alex Ashby and Tyrell McWellington went out yesterday on a 25-foot boat called Panda. They did not return at the usual hour and were thought lost. President of the Old Tobago Fisher Folk Association, Curtis Douglas, tells us more. We did find out and get to rest him probably after three this morning. We realized that his engine was given problems. The forward gear for the engine was not going in. So they had to use his whip to think, to try to reverse, to see how far he could come in short to get signal to call someone to contact us. That is how he was saved. And thank God that the sea was really good so that he would have been able to reverse. Mr. Douglas says that fisher folk from Palutuvia were able to follow the men's signal when they came close enough to shore. The issue of communication, he says, is an important one for the preservation of the lives of fishermen. Well, that's why we were trying our best to advocate to see how best we could equip um, fisher folk in the vicinity of Tobago with satellite phones because we go further than the average trailer at fisher folk. Trailer fisher folk go 5, 10 miles, we go up to 35, go to Barbados and Grenada. You know, we, go, we go distance. So that's the reason why we would need that because after a certain distance, the radios from ATFA, we realize that it don't pick up after a certain distance. And the cell phone after me roughly about 15 miles. Mr. Douglas says these phones are expensive and they have nevertheless been trying to acquire them. They have reached out to the fisheries division in hopes that they might share the cost of the equipment and so save fishermen in their quest to feed the nation.